Today, I'm gonna to be doing something a little bit different. I just purchased a Castmaster Lite GG5000. My furnace is just too large to use it for copper. So I need something smaller. And having a furnace that's smaller also means it heats up a lot quicker. And when I used to melt copper with mine, which you don't see very often, it takes like an hour just to get the metal melted. So that's why you're used to seeing me use it for aluminum only. So today, I'm gonna to be using it to melt copper, the Castmaster Lite GG5000. If you guys saw the video before, I had an evaporator coil a couple weeks back. I stripped off the aluminum and I was left with the copper. Now, I melted the aluminum down. The link will be in the description below. But today, I'm gonna to be using the Castmaster Lite GG5000 furnace to melt down the copper from that evaporator coil. So let's head outside and get right to melting. And it was at that moment that you thought that I was a total noob. Thanks for sticking around to the end. I made a few playlists for you that I think you would like. That one right there is currently my most favorite thing to do. Now that one right below it, that's one that I have a mixture of the Lost Foam and Sandcast. Ones that I think are super cool that I think you will enjoy. I post at least one new video a week, so make sure you subscribe and I will see you then.